Hey everybody, welcome back, unboxing time. Mary's here. Hello. And we're here to open up, I guess, in December. It seems awfully quick. Uh, 2018 box from uh, Comet TV again. Woo. Yeah, so they keep sending us cool stuff. Yeah. And we keep enjoying it. Of course, we give them a little bit of promotion, but hey, a lot of our friends actually use this. We found out after they started sending us stuff, <laughs> and like her dad watches uh, Babylon 5, yep. and things like that on there all the time, so it's like, oh, cool. You know, we get to help turn people on to things people we know already love, and uh, we get some cool stuff in the process. So, uh, with that said though, Comet TV, you can find all the links and information in the description below. But basically, it's an app, um, or it's over the air. It's all the things you need yeah. it to be. Luckily, it's uh, the over the air is affiliated with Fox. So it's like 56.2 or whatever. Well, that's in Lexington. Obviously, in it's Lexington. gonna be different. If I you go locally. Oh, okay, I'm sorry, I, I, I was busy. Uh, <laughs> no, you didn't. Let me just argue with you, because people love that. Let's do that instead. Uh, Oh, hey Echo, turn living room lights green. I forgot to be changing the lights. <laughs> um, so, I don't think, she, yes, she took it. Okay. All right, thank you. Um, what was I gonna say? Oh, and then comment TV, yeah. If you go to the website, wherever you are, you can put in like a finder. Like there's like, yeah. put in your zip code thing, it'll tell you what the over the air is. Or you can use their app for like your mobile devices or I have it on Apple TV. Yeah. That's pretty cool. They do some neat stuff, man. They had some awesome movies going the last couple of months. So I'm kind of anxious to get in here and see what we have. And again, it has the classified sticker on it. So that's why I'm like, is this, can't still be for November because it's already December, so. Yeah. Would you like to start? You might as well start. All right. There's not, there's rarely t-shirts, so. I have no idea. This could be one item for all I know, so. Oh, that's the coolest thing. Why'd you throw that away? No. <laughs> okay, again, here's her paperwork. All right, paperwork. It'll tell us about the movies and the shows. There's a t-shirt in here. Oh, there is a t-shirt? Would you like to go ahead and pull sure, the Sure, I'll pull the t-shirt. I don't know if that's a t-shirt. That feels different. No, it's a t- is it a t-shirt? Yeah, it's a t-shirt. <laughs> oh, it's, oh, it's a tank top. Skynet. Oh, that's actually really cool. That's like that vintage 80s look too. I like that. This thing is huge. I know, I'm amused by this just because what do we seem to always come across at the beginning or end of Doctor Who when we watch it lately? <laughs> oh, so Terminator. Terminator. <laughs> the Terminator movie, that's a good point, which is what we're gonna watch after these unboxings. Dude, this could this is probably like a dress if you put it on. Because <laughs> honestly, I don't know that I can rock sleep. Ooh, it'd be a very short dress. It's a dress I'd like to see you. Um, what are you doing later? <laughs> um, oh, oh, like ooh. Um, <laughs> Mary, what's in the box? While I try and get these awesome images out of my brain. All right. Let's oh see God. Else okay, I gotta. I seriously gotta stop thinking of ooh. seeing you in this. Oh, what is this? Oh, Christmas Day Marathon. Oh, it's okay. It's so <laughs> five. And Space 1999, probably like it's Space 1999 Marathon New Year's Eve. Oh, did they do what I think they did in here? Oh, that's creepy. All right, so we still got the Babylon 5, we still got the Space 1999, we've gotten some cool and stuff got, out of And we got some nutrition Pardon. facts there. Uh, let's see, serving oh. size, oh, it, it's all blank. No. Oh, it's all blank. I wonder if it actually is snacky foods or what? There is something else in this box. There's popcorn. Oh, more popcorn. From Costco. <laughs> I do like the idea that it's, it's like... It's popcorn. Yeah, I like the idea they give you popcorn. That that was all that's in it though? That's all that's in it. All right, all right. I mean, again, it's, this is not a subscription box. This right. is not something you buy or whatever. They've just been kind enough to be sending them to us, so I'm not complaining about that. It's just like, but oh, the, okay. The, the, the Kirkland popcorn from uh, Costco is actually pretty good, so. <laughs> all right. I, I, was just like, I, I just want to make sure people know I'm not knocking on for that. Right, yeah, no, no. <laughs> Um, this is really creeping me out in like the best of ways. I'm gonna pull this because something tells me they're playing the Blair Witch this month. Okay, is it one of those stick thingies? <laughs> oh, you creepy bastards. <laughs> yeah, you creepy bastards. <laughs> it's a little off, or is I it? I think it's missing legs. It's got very short legs. Oh, maybe there's more. T oh, it looks like it broke, maybe. Well, we'll find out in a minute. <laughs> I'm gonna feel for broken legs. I don't feel any broken. Ah! <laughs> your broken like that. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for hitting the, the knee that's still not recovered from, uh, sorry to bother you. <laughs> actually, I think it is. I think I'm just paranoid about other things. This is actually really cool, though very creepy, but it does look like my legs broke off and I don't feel them because that should be out longer. Mm -hmm. um, yeah, real quick story time in case you haven't heard this. Uh, first time I saw Blair Witch, the original, mm -hmm. um, was in the theater. I was working as a theater projectionist in like a 16 screen theater in North Carolina. And as a projectionist, you had to, when it was film, 
You had you uh, the movie came in like five or six reels, and you had to splice those reels together and put it on the platter, and then you're supposed to screen it to make sure you put it together correctly. Mm -hmm. So it was midnight on a weekday or something, and it was me and one of the managers, nobody else in the movie theater, watching The Blair Witch Project at midnight after the theater had closed. <laughs> I then needed to go thread all my projectors afterwards. He left. So I was the only one in the 16 theater upstairs in the creepy ass projection booth. Luckily I had to work the next morning because after threading like one projector, I was like, no, screw this, I'm out, I'm going home. I'm not, I can't handle this. <laughs> and what did I do when I went home? I went out to the back of the apartment, grabbed some twigs and started making these and leaving them around to freak my friends out. <laughs> so there you go, fun story. There's a little something else still in here. It's very curious as to what it's it is. A dog tag. Oh, cool. Dog Maybe tag for it. what? Oh, uh, let's see what the name on here is. John Connor! Oh, neat. So I guess they're gonna probably play Terminator. Well, since they gave us the Skynet shirt, yeah. Wouldn't it be funny if they didn't? They're just like, no, it's totally random. <laughs> I don't know, maybe those legs aren't supposed to be broken. I don't know. Special Forces, the Terminator, watch on comment. <laughs> <laughs> That's cute. It is. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, yeah. Um, how few, about you share with the rest of the class? There's a few maybe. good movies in there. So, on your feet, soldier, on your feet, says Sarah Connor of The Terminator. The sci-fi and horror classic The Terminator is blasting its way through Comet TV this December. Check out the classic and the birth of Cyberdyne Systems. Um, I don't need to read all of this. I'm just going to try and hit the beats for you guys, uh, the important stuff. Season 5, or season, the holiday season Babylon... Babylon 5 has a Christmas marathon, so after you sip your eggnog and trim the tree, turn on Comet TV for a spacey Christmas marathon starting at 10 slash 9 a.m. Central Time. And then on their Area 10 section, or is Area 10? What? Because they mentioned Area 10 last time, and they were showing cult films. Oh, yeah. they, so that might be another app. I, I will look into that. If that is true, I'll have the information in the description below. Okay. And uh, so the December box, of course, has the Terminator muscle shirt, because it has all the muscles. <laughs> nope, 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 nope. Not going to picture you in it again. Um, not right now, anyways. <laughs> um, exclusive Blair Witch holiday ornament, which is very, very cute. Terminator dog tag. Babylon 5 and Space 1999 custom cereal box. Ah, uh, okay. And uh, yeah, share your photos with the kid on Facebook and Instagram. Hashtag, hashtag, comma, TV. So that's okay. I'm not really going to show you that because I don't know if there's like contact stuff. I don't know if you're supposed to see. So uh, Babylon 5 Christmas Marathon starting at 10 a.m. 9 central. You can catch uh, what day? Oh, I guess that's on Christmas Day. Okay, that yes, makes sense. Mm -hmm. And then uh, Christmas Day, Tuesday, December 25th, starting at 10 a.m. 9 central. Ooh, Stigmata. Ooh, with special audio commentary. I haven't seen that movie in a long time. I really liked that. Patricia Arquette. I have already passed it though, unfortunately. December 8th and 9th. Oh, the dates are after. Oh, yeah. we oh we are. Yeah, and I did, I'm not late on this box. This box actually got to me a little late. This came on last Saturday. Yeah. Um. Anyway, sorry. Uh. So yeah, that's well. Okay, you missed all of those. Area ten then. Weeknights ten eight, ten nine central. They're gonna be watching the Adventures of Buckaroo Banzai, oh. which I've never actually seen. You never seen? No, nope, I bought the Blu-ray recently. So yeah, we'll have to check that out then. Maybe you can watch it with me. The Shout, The Cat Creature, The Blair Witch Project, which I still love and still think is an awesome film. I really like that sequel, too. Mm -hmm. uh, Disturbing Behavior, I remember. I think I remember that one. Um, that seemed pretty cool. I, I'll remind myself about it. They have some descriptions. Run Away, that was a cool movie. The Terminator, Future World, To All a Good Night, Haunted Honeymoon, Old Dracula, Jeepers Creepers. Okay, I have to... I'm What's old Dracula? Do you know? I do not know. Okay. The Curse, The Curse 2, Panja, Panga, 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 and more. So, uh, yeah, Blair Witch on Friday, Saturday. Okay, you can still see on uh, Thursday, December 20th at midnight, The Blair Witch. Because we're recording this on the 15th. Yeah. Uh, the Terminator, <clears throat> 1984, of course. Uh, let's see. You can still see that on Wednesday, December 19th at 10, 9 central. And Adventures of Buckaroo Banzai, you can still see Thursday, December 20th at 5, 4 central. Uh, sadly, it does not have a description for some of the other movies. I was very curious. Oh, here's and some more. And on their other channel, Charge. Yes, on Charge, which works just like Comet. I also have those links in there. That's like action-y stuff. Mm -hmm, that's definitely more their action-y stuff. Uh, hurtin' for a Burton. <laughs> Bert, uh, Burt Reynolds. That's what I would have thought, but it's a From Dust Till Dawn trilogy marathon. So I'm trying to figure out. Wait, where do, I love From Dust Till Dawn. Where does Burton? Is there a character named Burt? I don't recall there being a character named Burton. Anyways, or Burt. Uh, <laughs> oh, 
I guess the cop was Bert, maybe. Anyways, um, <laughs> you'll still be able to see this Saturday, December 22nd, starting at 2 slash 1 central, where they're going to show one of my all-time favorite movies, From Dusk Till Dawn. And then they're gonna show From Dusk Till Dawn 2, Texas Blood Money, ugh. And then they're gonna show From Dusk Till Dawn 3, Hangman's Daughter, which is actually a really good prequel. So you can definitely check those out on Charge. That's a good run. Okay. And then a uh, Chantastic Movie Marathon that you can catch Wednesday, December 19th at 10, 9 Central or Christmas Day, December 25th, uh, starting oh, at 8, Chantastic. 7 Central. Chantastic. That's what I said, Chantastic, didn't I? I, I, I heard it as Chantastic. I, I heard it as Chant instead of Chant. Oh, I got you, okay. I got you. Okay, kind of like gifts, 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 <laughs> gifts. Uh, the Forbidden Kingdom, Super Cop, and Accidental Spy. So that's pretty cool, too. And, of course, you still have Chips, the series, weekdays at 11 a.m., 10 Central, and weeknights at 6 slash 5 Central, and Babylon 5, and Space 1999. All kinds of good stuff, absolutely free. So there you guys go, and thank you, Charge. I mean, I really love that you guys keep doing this, and i got to yeah. be honest, I love the design of this. If this was a normal T-shirt, I'd totally keep it myself, but honestly, kind of <laughs> want to see her model this as a dress, so maybe Super Thank You. We'll see. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, so that's the charge bat box for uh, the month of December and definitely let us know if you guys are checking it out. We'd love to hear your comment stories. Mm -hmm. um, I'm pretty sure they check out the videos so they might hear you if you have suggestions or anything. But let us know. Geek out with us in the comments. We'd like to hear what you have to say. Mm -hmm. You can also click the thumbs up button and give us that thumb of encouragement because we do love to be encouraged. And I guess now I'm going to get out of here. I'm going to convince her to wear this and then open up some more stuff and we'll see you all later.